have gathered here to celebrate the wedding of our daughter Zoya with Hassan. As you all may know, the wedding took place last year in March at a time when COVID was at its peak. We are so glad that today we are able to celebrate together with our families and friends. Growing restless in the way Searching for a brighter day So I've known Zoya literally my whole life. We used to play basketball, Zoya the destroyer, the free throw queen, and yes, we did have our arguments, especially when it came to choosing what song next we played on our shared two gigabyte iPod Nano that had like capacity for like a hundred songs. And you know, we'd be on road trips to go visit Kala in San Jose, and we would just be like one earphone in the other, one earphone, and I'd be like, I wanna play this, no, I wanna play this. And it's just, but you know, those were great memories too as well. Sky is blue. When Zoya first introduced us to Hassan, I could immediately see how comfortable they were with each other. Now that they have each other, I see these goals and dreams coming true. Them standing by each other's side, never faltering in their love and support. Yeah, he told me about Zoya, and the way he was talking about her, I was like, I know this is something special. Zoya still had two tests of mine to meet. One was, does she like sports? Second, does she like Hassan's jokes? If not, can she help make them better? When I was moving, this guy flew all the way down, helps pack up my apartment, loads it up in a U-Haul, drives nine hours all the way back to Berkeley, and helps me move out. I learned a lot about Hassan on that drive as well. He has a horrible podcast taste. His dad jokes are terrible, but he is someone I wholeheartedly trust. And I know he will keep Zoya happy and he will love her and give her the love that she deserves. Throughout all these years, we've never seen Zoya happier than when she is with Hassan. Hassan has pushed Zoya out of her comfort zone and has taken her on many new adventures, and we can see the fulfillment that they've brought to each other's lives. For example, he introduced her to board games, and she introduced him to chai. And we pray that God enjoin and increase Zoya and Hassan in mutual love and mutual mercy. That God bless and give good health to their families. If there's one positive thing I can say about Zoya and Hassan's relationship, it's that I really admire the way that they care for each other and push each other to grow. We are so happy that Zoya is in good hands. We are very confident that you will take great care of Zoya through thick and thin. Together, inshallah, we will make each other happy. I wish you guys a lifetime full of happiness. I wish you guys nothing but blessings upon blessings. May the celebration of your love today light the way of your journey together. This is just the beginning, and we can't wait to see what's in store for the both of you. May Allah give them the ability and tawfiq to follow the right path and take care of the people around them.